Hey YouTube, Golden Boys Bricks here, shooting another video and giving you phase two update of my uh, city demolition and reconstruction. If you watched uh, phase one, uh, you remember I talked about, I took it all the way down to a uh, four by eight piece of uh, styrofoam there. You can see the pink underneath. And I put up all my modulars all there, lining one side of the street. And then you see starting on the left, I've got three of the creator houses, the gas station, the car dealership, the police station, the fire department. And then the uh, ambulance rescue uh, hospital set there. Then uh, the last row that's uh, nearest uh, the bottom of the screen there, you'll see that I have the uh, city pizza place, one of the bus stops slash train terminals, the uh, Lego store, and then a couple of my own uh, matching builds. Well, really four of my own matching builds on either side to uh, finish off the shopping area there. Then further on on the left, I have all the three-in-one modulars that have come out over the last couple years. And then finally, the train station right there on the very uh, corner on the left-hand side. And then I filled, obviously, the roads with uh, the vehicles that I had. So I won't spend a lot of time on that, but I want to show you what I've done uh, new since uh, our Phase 2 is now uh, completed. But you notice, first off, I added three road plates to uh, finish off uh, joining the two roads there. So where well, you see the blue car, the uh, cement mixer, and then the camper. You'll notice I put uh, put the stoplights back in uh, on each corner there. So that helped uh, with traffic control. And then a few uh, signs, fire hydrants, newspaper box. I added the little coffee shack right there, the coffee cabin. And then uh, the dumpster, garbage can, and then picnic bench. And then the big uh, addition here is I did a four-foot uh, long by uh, four foot wide section here and this is now my new airport setup if you remember from uh, my old uh, update it was pretty crowded and yeah, I used all of the uh, crossroads uh, base plates which really didn't have much of a runway effect it just looked all really just jumbled up so I actually used my straight row plates because I had so many left over from uh, the condensing that I did in phase one so you notice I have individual runway, the first one up there for the uh, VIP private plane. Then uh, the back one here for the cargo center, I've still got the LexCorp uh, forklift and the LexCorp guy still loading up that cargo center. Then I still didn't make any changes except I just switched the uh, entry around on uh, the airport in the back, put the limousine there, added uh, the train or a bus stop station right there in the corner. The uh, tower from one of the Avengers sets, I did put back up where I had it. And then over on the far right-hand side, you'll notice I've got the airport air show hangar. Then the two fighter jets, a porta potty And then really, I've just got extra space here if something interesting comes out for any of the other air for airplane air sets, I can add that in. Otherwise, it just really adds some nice negative space to give your eye a break. And then the uh, airplane, the airmail plane, helicopter right here uh, on the bottom on the right with a couple mini figures that are attached. So overall, I think if you look at the whole whole uh, city, the whole set, it is much easier to look at on the eyes. Uh, things really make sense. And I feel that it's a uh, very good update. Obviously, I like your feedback. And uh, let me know what you think. Or if there's other changes you'd like to see, please let me know. And uh, there's uh, one good pan of the whole entire city. And I look forward to uh, hearing from you guys. And stay tuned for Phase 3 as I've got a few more uh, ideas up my sleeve.